I am a graduate of Mississippi Delta. I stayed here four years. I took HVAC and I took industrial electricity slash industrial maintenance. Industrial maintenance technicians are responsible for assembling, installing, maintaining, and repairing machinery used in the manufacturing or industrial environment. Our first semester, we're gonna start them out in the computer lab and start teaching them some basic safety. Uh, they'll also learn uh, AutoCAD. I will take them in the lab to teach them how electricity operates, how it works, how to measure it with their meters. So I start them off at scratch and build them up. In second semester, after I've got them used to working with electricity, we start in on motor controls, and they'll go from DC voltage to AC voltage. Year two is a breeze. They learn hydraulics, pneumatics, PLCs. Uh, we do solid state motor controls, use the frequency drive, start stopping motors, uh, speeding up conveyors, things of that nature. It's just something different. They get to well that fourth semester, and they just get well-rounded and get prepared for the workplace. I like industrial maintenance because coming out of high school, I knew I wanted to have a trade, and I got told about this, which is pretty much every trade wrapped into one, so I was just, it ain't no better place to be. I don't get stuck in a rut. That's why I chose industrial maintenance, heating in there, for the simple reason I I'm not stuck in a building all day. I might be wiring up lights at a customer's house today. I might be working on a well motor tomorrow. Then they might want to go to a factory. Then they might want to go work for a welding company. A student will be able to decide what way he wants to go. Completion options include a career certificate, technical certificate, and associate of applied science degree. I heard it was a huge opportunity when you got out. You could find a job, make plenty of money, you know, have your retirement benefits, all that. If they're serious, they can get a job anywhere. Well, I tell them if they have a willingness to learn, I can show them how to get out and get a good job and they can make all the money they want to. You know, they get top pay when they graduate. For two years, you can make anywhere from $18, $24 an hour, somewhere in that range. I really like when I see a student learn something. That's very rewarding. 